Hey guys, welcome back to another video, it's Christina. So this video is really gonna be a Sunday reset slash get my life together video because I have so much that I need to do today to get my toes done, number one. Then I'm going to the alterations. Then I need to go to the mall to also make a lot of returns. I just have a lot of things I need to return and ship off. And then I'm just gonna go hygiene shopping because I'm running low on a lot of the things that I need like body wash and lotion and all those things like that. So I need to go to Target to get some of that. I'm gonna come home, cook dinner, and then I I really need to clean up because I just haven't swept in a while. I haven't done laundry in about a week. So I just need to do all those other household things. So yeah, that's kind of what I have to do today. And I just wanted to take you guys along with me. And I also want to show you guys my outfit because like I told you, I'm just running errands, but I've really been trying to put more intention into even like days like this where I'm not really doing anything that exciting. It makes a difference. I feel like it makes a difference on how people see you. It makes a difference on how you see yourself. But yeah, I'm just trying to look the part because if I want to be that woman that's put together, that looks nice, I gotta start dressing like her. Like I have to start acting like that. So I'm just trying to be way more intentional about how I present myself when I leave the house, even if I'm just running errands. The outfit is just this tube top I got from H&M, this purse from Amazon, and then this skirt from Meshki. And I think it's very simple. Like it's definitely not over the top, but I just feel like it's a classy, everyday, casual look. And I just wanna start dressing like this more. Like not just wearing sweatpants or jeans. The only thing about it is I have no shoes to wear with this outfit because I don't have any white shoes. And honestly, I've been spending so much money as it is just with new clothes that I'm not about to go out right now and get some, well, I might. If I see some cute shoes at the mall, I might go out and get some. However, right now I'm just gonna wear some black um, sandals with this, even though it doesn't match. Like, don't get on me. I know that doesn't match at all, but it is what it is. And yeah, this is the look. I really like it. I think it's very simple, but cute at the same time. But yeah, I'm about to go out. The first stop is getting my toes done, and I will see you guys there. Okay, I just got my clothes altered, and honestly, like half of them I didn't actually need altering like I thought I did. She just told me like if you're gonna wear heels with them, it's not gonna be that long, and she was right, like she had a point. So I only ended up getting like two pairs of jeans altered, and I think one pair of like dressy pants altered because they were too long, and that was it, but yeah. So now I'm about to head to the nail salon. I just need my toes done. I think for my nails, I'm just gonna stick to stick-ons or glue-ons because I don't know I think they still look cute and I think it's saving money because I got these from Amazon and it came with like five packs of these for like $26 and that's saving so much money if you think about it because they last for like two weeks two to three weeks anyway so I think I'm just gonna keep getting my nails done but like doing my own nails like doing stick-ons or glue-ons and then I'm just gonna get my toes done because I think they need to make glue-ons for toes I think that's a smart idea anyway yeah so I'm about to just go get my toes done real quick and then yeah okay guys i just finished getting my toes done i needed that like now that i see what my feet look like done i'm like how did i go this long without having my toes done but anyway i'm about to head to the mall now i just need to make some quick returns and then i just got invited to like a rooftop jacuzzi party but i'm not gonna go home and get changed so i don't even know if i'm actually gonna go to that but this this is how my days always end up like i get invited to stuff and it's like i had a set plan about what i was gonna do today because i told you guys i have a lot to do so it's like should i go or should i stick to the plan and just do my little errands and clean my house we will see what i end up doing probably probably going back home because i'm not even in a swimsuit or anything like that so we'll see but i'll catch up with you guys later guys i just got to the mall and when i tell you every single parking spot in this mall is filled like it took me five whole minutes to find a parking spot and it was just because someone left and they drove out but literally there's like no parking spots here i've never been to a mall where it's literally like every single spot is taken and that really kind of irritated me because why is it so packed okay, so i just want to return my top that's all i'm trying to do the fact that i had to it was more than five minutes it was at least 10 minutes of me trying to drive around and find a parking spot anyway that aside i just pulled up to the mall and i'm about to go in and return this top and get my pretzels i have to get onto annie's today because i just i want it so bad and then after that i'm just gonna get out of here because that just frustrated me really bad but yeah okay guys so i left the other mall i'm at lennox i got my pretzels oops my pretzels from um cumberland 
And yeah, I'm about to just stop in here real quick. And I guess I am going to the barbecue thing because he said there's going to be some hot dogs. I love hot dogs. So I'm just going to stop by, get a plate, and then I'm on my way. Hopefully I can show you guys something. I feel like it's just been me in the car the whole time. But I've just been in a quick in and out doing stuff. So I haven't really had much to show anyway. But yeah, so I'm about to go in here return this from aritzia and then go to this guy's cookout however my engine is overheating it literally said idle engine something hot temperature and that can't be good so i don't know i know my car had the engine light on but i just thought it would be fine and i had a problem with it like two weeks ago where it wasn't starting up so i don't really know hopefully i can just get where i need to get today because i told you guys i have a lot to do it always happens like the the most you need your car the less reliable it is like i need my car to get around just do my little errands go to this barbecue and hopefully it just lasts long enough for me to do that and then i'll just worry about everything else tomorrow because i do have stuff to do tomorrow but it's not necessary it's not mandatory so we'll see guys i just hope my car is okay and i hope i have time to still go to target and get my hygiene stuff and go home and clean because it's already like five ish and i wasn't expecting this barbecue thing to happen so hopefully i can just pop my head in and leave but anyway just went on a tangent about that but yeah guys i'm gonna get inside this mall so i can return this and get out of here so i just left linux real quick easy in and out oh i'm just gonna go to target because there's a target over here so i'm thinking why not go to target before i go to the little cookout i asked him how many people were gonna be there he said five so i don't know what i'm getting myself into we'll see what it's like when i get there but anyway so i'm going to target because i just would rather go to target first so i don't have to go to target after because i hope i'm not there long but if i am i just would rather have that out of the way and there's a target like point like four minutes away from here so I'm about to make a quick target run and then I will be on my way to this little cookout thing and then I'm gonna go home to cook dinner, to clean my apartment, and I think that's really it. Cook dinner, clean, yeah, that's it. So, yeah. Target and heading to the barbecue. It's literally two minutes from me, so I'm about to pull up like right now. So I'm just now leaving that little get together. It was only like five of us, but they did have chicken. They had hot dogs. It was a vibe. The rooftop was beautiful. It's a really nice apartment. Um, it was chill. Like I'm, it wasn't a lot going on, but it was definitely like very low key chill vibes. But it's like nine, and I was not supposed to stay that long. And so I'm just about to go home. I'm still cleaning my kitchen. I'm still gonna like clean everything and do that. I'm not gonna cook though because since they had food there, I don't really see the need to cook. And plus, I forgot to take the salmon out of the refrigerator. So glad that I had food here so that it doesn't even matter anymore because I already ate. So yeah, I'm just gonna go home, clean my kitchen, do like a clean my bathroom, do a really nice um, reset, take a nice shower and go to sleep. So I will see you guys when I get back home. Hey guys, I just got home. It is like 9.30ish, but I'm still about to clean up and um, do all that because I just, I don't know. I, this city, one thing about this city is that you can get distracted really easily. Like I had no intention of spending like three hours at a barbecue today like i was just gonna go out run my errands come home clean the house and go on about my day but you know it's hard not to get distracted here but i'm just trying to like, balance everything but now that i'm home i'm still gonna clean because that's what i told myself i was gonna do today and i'm not gonna let myself constantly get distracted by just random things but anyway i just wanted to show you guys what i got from target today because i didn't show you guys so the first thing i got was this candle i think this smells really nice so yeah got this i got this face mask i never tried this but i don't know i just want to do something peaceful and relaxing tonight so i got this i got 
I got some razors too, just because I was out of them. I also got these eye, these eye little patches. I'm not sure, what are these called? Eye, eye masks, I guess. I don't know, they just seemed like a vibe. So I got them. I don't know if they're reusable or one-time use. I hope they're reusable because they're like $5. And $5 for a one-time eye mask is kind of a ripoff, but we'll see. And then I got some Q-tips. I was just running out of Q-tips. I got these. Got some body scrub. I love this brand of body scrub. I don't know why. They always try a different flavor, but today I got pink hibiscus and I'm excited to use this. I just love this body wash or this body scrub so much. I was running out, so I got some of this. And then I just got some cream for ingrown hair. Like I've been having ingrowns lately, like not really bad, but just like after I shave on my legs or something. So I got this end skin solution for ingrown hairs, razor bumps and shaving. So hopefully this works and I got another one because I don't know I don't know which one is gonna work and which one's not or if they if either one work so I just got two just to see which one I like better and those are all like the hygienic stuff that I got from Target today and yeah so I'm about to get to cleaning the kitchen because let me I just need to stop procrastinating I've been needing to do this so I'm just gonna do that and then take a shower and unwind and then go to sleep so yeah Somewhere when no one can find you Passion out in the sticks with nothing around you Katy, Texas, Dallas, Texas You know a different environment Cause you got desires I know, I know Cause you got desires I know, I know Cause you got desires You got that fire And I'm not alive Self-control is never been a thing Don't think it'll help if there's a ring with a dollar Where I'm from, they serve it so the things You come from a city where there's lean with the dollars How the fuck you keep so many seats? How you going to think it must still be filled with How the fuck you see so many beats? Tickets to them places don't go cheap I see it back in church, remember who took it at first
for that I just honestly as much as I try to plan my days out I just never know how they're gonna end up so even though I did want this to be more routine more organized I feel like this was a very accurate represent representation of my life and like how my days go so I hope you guys enjoyed it I know it was probably on the more boring side but let me know what you thought and I will see you in my next video bye